What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily. Let's get into the tech news. First story of the day is if you didn't know, we talked about it yesterday though. The Galaxy S10 5G was released yesterday for Verizon and we're starting to get some videos showing off the speeds that they're getting. Now this is specifically in Chicago because the 5G network for Verizon is basically nowhere. But anyways, as you can see from this video, this guy gets over one gigabit per second. This is extremely fast, obviously. This is the type of speeds you wanna be seeing on 5G. Once everyone has 5G phones and once 5G is everywhere, you probably won't see speeds this fast. I would suppose they'll probably settle somewhere in between 300 to 700 megabits per second. I, I maybe once in a while it'll get over a gigabit per second, but regardless, this is, this is a very new network, very limited area of the network as well. So again, you're not gonna see these speeds most likely once everybody has 5G, but still, it's very promising to see that you could potentially get speeds this fast to do what? Load a web page, download an app, download a movie. Whatever, maybe there's things we're not, haven't even thought about yet that we could use these speeds for, but regardless, it's really nice to see. And the last story of the day is about the Galaxy S10 line of devices in the United States. This is, you know, for every carrier that is coming out, T-Mobile, Sprint, Verizon, AT&T, the unlocked version. Well, the May update is finally rolling out again for us. I guess Sprint users already have it. So if you have Sprint, make sure you check for it. I believe you'll already have this update. But regardless, there was another, there's one thing missing. Basically, since the April update internationally, Night Mode has come out for the Galaxy S10 line of devices, and now we're, it, it didn't come out in the United States, and now we're onto the May update for USA, and still, Night Mode for the camera is still not out for the Galaxy S10 line of devices here. I don't know why, I don't know what they're working on to keep it away from the United States, but regardless, you won't see it in the May update as well, unfortunately. Um, probably gonna have to wait now until June. And what that, what it even does though, basically it just allows you to take better night photos. Um, instead of it just automatically deciding if it needs to come up or not, like it does currently on the phone, it'll actually be a dedicated mode on the camera and it still is not included, unfortunately. That's it. Thanks for watching. Even actually, even before that, I know a lot of people that already have this. Um, at least some of the website have said it's not that great anyway. So maybe we're not missing out on anything, but still, it would be nice to have for sure. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. New videos every single day. My question out to you guys is: What do you think about no night mode? Do you need it on your Galaxy S10 phone for taking photos? Or do you think, hey, it already takes really dark, nice photos anyway? Let me know in the comments down below and I'll see you guys down the road. Peace!